Hey guys, how are you doing? And in this episode, we are going to see how to fix WhatsApp auto backup not working problem in iPhone. After the last update, users have started noticing, you know, all of a sudden that the WhatsApp chat backup is not happening automatically, even the phone is connected to Wi-Fi network. Within the WhatsApp settings, when the auto backup is set to daily, weekly or monthly, according to the schedule that you have selected, the backup should happen. So we will try some troubleshooting steps to fix this problem. Also, we have plenty of iPhone, iPad and Mac related tips and tricks. Don't forget to search our channel to find them faster. The very first troubleshooting step you have to do is check for app updates by opening app store and then navigate to the updates section by tapping on your profile picture at the top right corner. Swipe down to refresh and get the latest app updates and make sure to update WhatsApp to the latest version. If there are any bugs related to WhatsApp backup services not happening, you know, that could have been fixed by WhatsApp in the latest update. And the next troubleshooting step that you need to try is do a simple restart of your iPhone by pressing and holding the volume down button and then the side button then slide to power it off and then you can press and hold the side button to restart and you know sometimes if it is the problem related to your iPhone the iOS version then a simple restart could help fixing such problem. The next important troubleshooting step is make sure that you have background app refresh on for WhatsApp. In some cases, like if the background app refresh is off, then any application or system services auto update or any background upload that needs to be done to the service server could be interrupted. So in such case, you can temporarily try to turn on the background app refresh only for WhatsApp and keep all the other applications that you don't want to use the system resources, you know, can be kept off and then check whether it is working or not. As the last troubleshooting step, navigate to settings, general, then navigate to iPhone storage. And if the page takes longer than usual time, you can try the troubleshooting step that I have already recommended uh, in our channel. So I'll leave a link to that in the description and in the first comment. And within this iPhone storage, you have to navigate to WhatsApp. And there you can see two options which says offload app and delete app. Right now we are going to delete just the application, not the data. As you can see, the documents and data have 5.2 to GB consumed in my iPhone. And tapping on off offload app will delete only the application all the files related to the application not the data or user stored files your chat messages and attachments everything will be safe so perform offload app and then reinstall whatsapp and check auto backup is working after that or not this is the last solution that will definitely work if the previous troubleshooting steps didn't help you fix the problem. If you find this video useful, don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Thank you and have a wonderful day.